A multi-center study led by the University of Maryland is testing the safety and effectiveness of the first-ever mRNA vaccine against malaria, a disease that strikes 250 million people a year in sub-Saharan Africa, killing more than 600,000. This mRNA vaccine is based on a protein called the circumsporozoite protein that has been known to protect against malaria using other vaccine platforms. Like the COVID-19 mRNA vaccines, the new malaria vaccine uses the power of genetics to provide protection. What this means is that we can take malaria proteins that are known to be protective using other vaccine platforms and insert that into the mRNA technology platform to look at the specific immune responses and hopefully we'll be able to see success with this product similar to what was seen with COVID-19. Also like the mRNA COVID vaccines, the malaria vaccine can be programmed to fight variants. The unique part about mRNA vaccine technology is that we're able to plug and play multiple antigens. For instance, we know that many of us have received the, the bivalent booster vaccine for COVID-19. So this platform allows one to insert multiple variants of a protein for malaria. If the vaccine prompts a good immune response, the next step will be to expose vaccinated volunteers to malaria to see how well they're protected. For the University of Maryland School of Medicine, I'm Larry Roberts.